Asian Water Buffalo. The Asian Water Buffalo, aka Domestic Water Buffalo, is a large bovid that originated in the Indian subcontinent, Southeast Asia, and China, but it's currently found throughout the world. More people depend on them than any other domestic animal, as they're responsible for tilling the thick mud of rice fields and their milk is richer in fat and protein than that of dairy cattle. Giant Eland The giant eland is native to the open forests and savanna of Central Africa, and is the biggest antelope in the world. Their horns are actually primarily used to loosen soil in search of mineral lick sites while out grazing on grasses, foliage, and branches. To adapt to the heat of the day, this ungulate is primarily nocturnal while during the day they rest in sheltered areas. Sable Antelope the Sable Antelope is an antelope that inhabits the wooded savanna in East and Southern Africa. To get essential minerals, this species will visit salt licks, but they've also been known to chew on discarded bones for additional calcium. They are more active in morning and evening, when temperatures are slightly cooler. Impala an impala is a medium-sized antelope that looks like a mix between a goat and a deer. They don't grow especially large, only coming up to the chest of an average-sized adult man at 3.5 feet, but they have long spiraling horns that add up to three more feet. Alpine ibex. This is a species of wild goat that lives in the mountains of the European Alps. Their majestic horns are used to defend themselves against predators as well as for when males fight for access to females, usually using their horns to butt heads and crash into one another. Hebridean sheep. The Hebridean sheep is considered to be an ancient breed from Scotland, and is relatively small and fine-boned compared to other sheep, and have black or dark brown wool. Their wool and fleece are very effective at deflecting water from the humid environment. Mouflon. The mouflon is thought to be the early ancestor of our modern, domesticated sheep. They're native inhabitants to the Caucasus, northern and eastern Iraq, and northwestern Iran. The horns of mature rams are curved and nearly complete a full revolution, and are used during fights. The males will fight each other for dominance, both in securing their hierarchy in the group and for the ability to mate with females. Marker The marker is a large species of wild goat, also natively known as the shakawat, potentially from the Persian word for snake. This could be because of the large, coiled horns, but also for their uncanny ability to kill snakes that threaten them. Edax the Adax is a white endangered antelope that inhabits the Sahara Desert. They prefer to live in smaller groups of only three to five animals, primarily roaming and feeding on desert grasses and small bushes. They're part of a matriarchal society, with the oldest female being the herd's leader. Black Buck This animal is the only living species of the genus antelope, distantly related to antelopes, and lives on the Indian subcontinent. They generally live on open plains and woodlands in herds ranging from 5 to 50 members, usually containing only one dominant male. This male is noticeably larger than that of the females.